So there are four parts to this exam that there are a total of 40 questions. So 10 questions in each section. Okay, the exam is 30 minutes long and there'll be recordings, four different recordings of conversations and monologues. Usually there'll be a monologue and then part two, there'll be a conversation about uh, everyday situation. Part three will be um, more conversation with up to four people. And part four will have another monologue. This will be on more of an academic subject. Okay, so here are the different types of topics, everyday social interactions, academic subjects, assignments, okay, and the focus, right? The ability to understand the main ideas and detailed factual information, the options and attitudes of speakers, the purpose of a sentence, why is somebody saying something, and evidence of your ability to follow the development of ideas. Okay, so let's look at the different types of sample tasks that you can see. First type we have is multiple choice, and we have matching, and the plan, the map, the diagram labeling. Then we have task type four, form, notes, table, flowchart, summary completion, and task type five, sentence completion, and also short answer questions. Okay, so let's look at some sample questions now. now. So multiple choice, okay? Choose the correct letter A, B, or C. Okay, so this is an example of a question, number nine, type of insurance chosen, okay? So you look, you're looking out for something similar to this word chosen, A, economy, was it B, standard, or C, premium, okay? So you have to kind of circle uh, the correct one. The customer wants goods delivered to, where does he want the, go the goods delivered, okay? So words in the questions are key, for example, chosen and deliver. Next, we have sentence completion. Okay, so write no more than two words for each answer. Um, studying with the Open University demanded a great deal of, we can use this of something. There's a lot of something. So pay attention to keywords, demanded. I found I needed to maintain a high level of motivation. Okay, so this of is, is great and you can see in this one is level and a great deal of motivation very good let's look at this one studying and working at the same time improved Rachel's something skills okay so try to think of different types of skills and uh, improved and skills okay another thing was that I got very good at time management because I had to fit time uh, for studying around a full-time job Okay, so time management skills, right? She got very good at this, improved. So it was helpful that the course was structured in, um, helpful and structured, okay? What makes it easier, easier, similar to helpful, is that the degree is made up of modules, okay? So the course, the degree was structured, was made up of, in, Modules, okay, so modules is the answer here. Uh, she enjoyed meeting other students at, okay, so at the preposition here, where? Where did she meet them? Okay, so at summer schools, they're great because you meet all the other people struggling with the same things as you. So you're really looking for a place here. Well, you're listening for a place, right? And when you hear this summer schools, okay, that's the answer. Okay, the next task type we see is short answer questions. So write no more than three words and or a number for each answer. What two factors can make social contact in a foreign country difficult? Okay, so something that's difficult in a foreign country. So you're thinking what, you can even think what, what is difficult for you in a foreign country, right? Um, you know, maybe the body language that people have, the language that they speak, um, different uh, cultural norms, right? So this is what you listen for, and then this is the, the text of the listening. But when you're living in a foreign country, it can be more difficult. Not just because of the language, so yes, the language, right? 
um, but because customs may be different. So we have language and customs. Okay, so here we have which types of community group does the speaker give examples of? So he has theater and other types of groups. What type of groups are there? Um, social groups, yoga groups. Okay, so you're thinking, you're looking for something like that, right? So first the speaker mentions the word theater, then, or if you play an instrument, you could join music groups. Music. Uh, or if you like the idea of finding out about local history, there'll be a group for that too. Local history, local history group. Okay, uh, let's look at this one. In which two places can information about community activities be found? Okay, so where do you think? A community center, a library, a church, something like that, right? Uh, and the best places to get information about things like this are either the town hall or the public library. So use what you know, okay, to think think of like what type of word are you looking for here? Two places, you're looking for a place, right? Next one we see is matching, okay, focus, listening for detail, the ability to follow a conversation between two people. Read options carefully and focus on key words and synonyms of these key words, right? Um, while you listen. So in what time period can the flow projects help with the issues 26 to 30 below? So right, you're listening to the people talking about uh, El Nino and global warming and these um, different things. And you think, is this at present or in the near future or in the long term future? So you'll have to put A if this is, is El Nino a present thing, do you think? Probably right, global warming is maybe in the near future. So use what you kind of know already, sustainable fishing practices. Okay, that's probably in the future. Um, but listen to what they say and try to understand, okay? Okay, now let's look at the diagram part. Um, complete the notes on the diagram below. Okay, so this kind of can help you. And um, if there's a picture here that can help you what's happening. Right, and um, write no more than three words and or a number for each question. Right, so focus relating an idea to a visual representation, right? And uh, so here, look at this question. Average distance travel. So you're looking for a number here, right? Um, and just try to give yourself a few seconds, to try to understand what is happening here, right? There's a boat and um, something is coming there uh, and there's a satellite. Okay, here. Okay, here's a form. Complete the form below. Uh, write no more than three words this time. Okay. Um, here's an address to be collected from. And uh, well, what do you think this is? 29 something. Uh, that's a normal address, a postcode. You're listening for a number again here. Um, and then the width. Okay. Here's the width, the length is 1.5 meters, so you're looking for what, one meter probably, the height, one meter could be the answer there, and what's inside, clothes, food, use this um, to help you guess, right, a total estimated value. Um, okay, so let's move on to a table, okay, complete the table below, write no more than three words and or a number for each answer, right, so it's very important you look here, venue, okay. We have Cinema 2, Gallery 1, right? So what are we looking for? You know, something, uh, some place again. Uh, and prices, right? And uh, numbers again. So it's really good to practice listening out for numbers, right? Because this will help you a lot, right? And then the event, the name. this is the name of the film you're looking for and the name of the art ex exhibition. Okay, the next one is a plan. Label the plan below, choose five answers from the box and write the correct letters A to I next to questions 11 to 15. Okay, so this you'll have to understand the directions, right? When you walk in on your left, there is the um, art collection or something like that, okay? And try to understand all of this. You know, this is great just to practice this before you do the exam so that you have an idea, like all of these examples, right? And then we have notes, and um, complete the notes below. Similar question again. 
uh, well known for complex um, well known for what is the National Art Center well known for okay probably great paintings or something like that right use your knowledge to guess and look out for certain words that you're looking for right um, okay so that's the end of the listing uh, I hope that helps you out remember to check out